Coming up at midday, performances, powerful speakers at a unity march. The members of the black LGBTQ plus community in Iowa, their message to Iowans. Then COVID-19 antibody testing is easier to find now. The Central Iowa Pharmacy behind ways that you can get results in as little as 10 minutes. This is Local 5 News Midday. We are Iowa. Good morning. Thanks so much for joining us for your midday program. Got a lot to get to. In fact, recapping what was a historic session in your state house matters. Lawmakers got through the COVID shortened 2020 legislative session and a last minute piece of abortion legislation is on its way to the governor's desk. The Iowa House and Senate approving this measure. It would mandate a 24 hour waiting period for a woman to get an abortion. If it sounds familiar back in 2018, the Iowa Supreme Court struck down a 72 hour waiting period that was passed by the legislature for a woman citing it as unconstitutional. Legislation to strengthen Iowa's animal, animal cruelty is also on its way to Governor Reynolds' desk. Supporters say Iowa's laws on animal cruelty, some of the weakest in the nation. That is a theme that has continued for the past few years. The Community and Pet Protection Act, among other things, increases criminal penalties for animal abuse and neglect. It also removes an exemption where an owner is barred from being charged with animal abuse for abusing their own pet. They also passed a controversial bill limiting automatic mailing absentee ballot request forms. It's something that was done this past uh, primary season, set a record. Instead of a ban, the version on the governor's desk requires a legislative committee to make those changes. Secretary